diagnosis of this disease is accessible also throughout the primary healthcare network of Fiji. So we really should be making an effort to detect cases as much as possible. Because unfortunately here, like in many countries of the Pacific, access to care um, sometimes comes in a little bit too of a late time. We would like people to come earlier, as soon as they develop the symptoms of the disease. Under the Global Fund Grant and Technical Assistance of WHO in partnership with the Ministry of Health, we hope to significantly reduce the burden of TB and mortality in Fiji. And this can only be possible by ensuring increased detection and high quality directly observed treatment. There is a need also to empower people in the communities to actively participate in TB control activities. Compared to 2012, which had 218 TB cases, last year we had 385 TB cases. When I saw this figure, I was a bit worried. But then I saw the next statement, it says, this shows the increase in cases is attributed mainly to the commitment of the Ministry of Health and Medical Services to improve TB control services in all divisions in Fiji. And perhaps this shows our stronger emphasis on trying to identify where these cases are. <coughs> the National TB program is expected to, to detect more cases through its new initiative by actively screening high-risk groups and improving access to screening in the hard-to-reach areas nationwide. <coughs>